treat you good. Right, Jared here, rockarazzi.com, 987fm.com. We are so blessed, privileged to have two members of the band Mumford and Sons. Thanks so much for joining us today, you guys. You're very welcome. Thanks so, for having us. It's cool. So tell us a little bit about what brings you into the station, first of all. Uh, uh, music, mostly, yeah. along with our um, sort of budding male model careers, uh -huh. which are going pretty well. Is that going well? Yeah, City of Dreams, City of Angels. Uh -huh. Thought we'd check out LA. Well, we thought we'd let LA check us out, really. <laughs> Ben's having more success than I am at the moment. Oh, yeah? I've just yeah, been told yeah. to lose weight. <laughs> all right, mate. <laughs> Hey, no offense taken. Whatever. Can we start this off on the wrong foot? Should yeah, we edit this yeah. out? Yeah. Hey, I'm just curious. So, listen, so our fans statewide that, that may not be familiar with you guys yet, if they're living in a hole or whatever it may be, <laughs> um, give us a little bit of an elevator pitch as, as quickly and concisely as possible. Where are you guys from? How long have you been doing this? Etc. Uh, okay. <clears throat> so we're selling ourselves. Let's, let's do it. Okay. Don't buy our record. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we just we have four guys from London, England, uh -huh. and we're in LA today, playing some songs. We're on tour in America. Been on tour since we started as a band. Don't really know how to describe our music, but we would like people to come to our shows. I mean, I mean, you, wow! 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 wow. 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 Yeah, we're sense. not we're not we're not very good at selling ourselves. That's I think okay. Ameri I don't know. We were just at doing a like we did a little gig in an office building about an hour ago and we were with some people from our record label who who kind of like start every kind of little mini gig we do with like an explanation of who we are but then they kind of try and hype us up and we just stand there like oh don't do that and we i don't know i think maybe it's more of an american thing but we 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 we, 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 we don't yeah we don't I don't know. We don't know how to talk about ourselves well, very well. That's okay, because the music does the talking, which is, I'm sure, what, what you'd prefer. How would you describe the, the sound? Because for me, when I listen to the stuff, and hopefully this won't offend anybody in the band. Yeah. But it's like it feels very Celtic rock to me. It feels very roots driven in that kind of yeah. history of music. That's Is that not offensive at all? Okay. No. Yes. I think we because there are four of us and we all creatively put in as much as we can to the songs. There's obviously like a whole host of influences that we could bore you with, but we won't. Um, <laughs> So what are you doing? Just hanging out. <laughs> that is our banjo player, Winston. Fantastic. So um, tell us a little bit about... <laughs> you, you, did you get him? <laughs> okay, so you're so obviously you're, you're here in LA now. Where's the tour take you next? We're heading um, south and then east. Okay. So we're going on to like Phoenix, Arizona and then into Texas. Going to be at Bonnaroo. Oh, cool. It's going to be very exciting. It's the first uh, England game of the World Cup. Right. USA England. Should we talk about this? Should we have a little bit of a, a, a USA England? Oh, you like. Okay. So, I think we're going to win 2 1. Yeah, prediction of the. <laughs> I actually think that I prefer to be the underdogs. And I think that <laughs> if, if America are going to ever get good at this game, this is this will be the year to show it. Right. I, mean, I really hope we win, but I think it could be an upset that will not. In any way affects England's performance the rest of the World no, Cup. We're still going to England's still, still going to win the group. The final stages, yeah. Okay. And, and so you have a gig the same night of the of the match. We're trying to look at the... timings. We're trying to we 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 might have to pull the gig. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. Especially. Yeah. We might have to pull the gig. So we're just looking at timings now. We're getting our people on it and figuring it out. But apparently they got big screens at Bonnaroo. Right. So well, your fans will understand, right? I mean, if you if we yeah. have announced this that. They can get their tickets back and the money back. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's a festival. There are loads of other bands to see. <laughs> loads of other better bands as well. So I think if it does clash, we'll just say 
come watch the football with us. <laughs> I love it, I love it. We can sing uh, England chants instead right. of Mumford and Sons songs, right, right. which is it. fine by us. It's empty in the valley of your heart. The sun, it rises slowly as you walk away from all the fears and all the faults you've left behind. The harvest left no food for you to eat. You cannibal, you meat eater, you sing. But I have seen the same, I know the shame in your defeat But I will hold on hope and I won't let you choke Under noose around your neck and I'll find strength in pain I will change my ways, know my name as it's born again I'm a, I'm a huge fan of, of your record, and to be honest, I, I wasn't turned on to it at all until I met Julie, the program director here, who was like, check out this band, and I love it. We've been listening to it this morning, nice. and the video was smashing. I love the video. Great. Um, what's in, in your heads, what's the ultimate goal? I mean, do you want to sell out arenas? England winning the World Cup. Besides, <laughs> besides the, your fantasy, your dream. Oh. But, but besides, besides that, I mean, is it to, like I said, is it to sell out arenas? Is it to just continue to make a living with your music? Uh, <laughs> start making a living. Start making, we yeah. could. Well, it's not really size isn't so much a part of the dream. I think um, I think length of time doing it. It's like we'd like to be doing this for a while. So any small steps we can make in that direction uh, would be great. Just uh, staying true to what we're doing, really. But we haven't quite worked it out yet. Um, you were born in the states? Yeah, I was born in in Anaheim, near Belinda. Wow. And, uh, and how did the how did the Switch up. Uh, we, uh, my family moved back to England when we were. I was six months old. They're all English, okay. so. Okay. But um. So you have a California birth certificate. I do, and an American passport, which just means I get to skip the queues at the airport, which is awesome. I want to know about your tattoos because these are some of the best tattoos I've seen. These, That's these a new are, one. These are this is this is my Brighton. Son. I just got this the other day. Like your son. Brighton. Yeah, we yeah. have a three month old. Nice. Ah, oh, nice. Right. And so, uh, Brighton. I can't, I can't, I won't strip down totally for you guys. Go on. Winnie oh, just did it. Yeah. <laughs> should I show him the yeah, tattoo? Yeah. <laughs> this Rock is awesome. Thing. Let's oh. all do it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. That's nice. That is really, really nice. well done. I'm just talking about your body, not even talking about the tattoo. <laughs> Sorry. Should we, we, we argue, Nick? <laughs> no. Do you know what? <laughs> I haven't got the, I haven't got the heart. My name's Marcus. And I'm Ben. And we're in a band called Mumford and Sons, and we're workaholics, rockaholics, folkaholics, talkaholics, talkaholics. And I don't have a shirt on for some. <laughs> ah, yeah! No, he doesn't. Thank you, Thanks, guys. Thanks, man. Hey, it was fun. Well, I'll treat you good.